Hello and welcome to another iBeacon demonstration. We haven't done a demonstration in a little while, but we want to show you what we've been up to. We're very proud to have just released um, Place App, Place CMS, our content management system, and Place Beacons out to public beta, and you can get the public beta. Sign up for it at www.westcompass.com. Please do so. Um, this is uh, what we'll see here today is Place App along with Place Beacons with content coming from the Place CMS. Now, just so you know what we're, what we're looking at here, we've got a couple of beacons here on the table as well, some other beacons. So I've got multiple beacons going on, and uh, we've got a, a, a 5S and a iPad Air here. And what we're going to do here is I'm going to move this particular device, and we're going to move it over by other beacons. So I'm going to go ahead and move this out here, and you'll see that that'll change. So it's ranging content. So as I go over to different beacons, I just passed the uh, LG beacon, so it switched to LG for a second, but it'll switch over here. So as I'm going past different beacons, it is in fact showing me appropriate content. Now let's talk a little bit about the application itself, the application, iPad and the app, iPad and um, phone supports both landscape of course and let's get it on the landscape here landscape mode as well as um, portrait mode in both uh, the app has something a history as well let's go ahead and get that back to portrait mode a history as well so as I'm walking through you know a museum or using this in any other potential use case real estate you know there's any number of different use cases as well, I may encounter beacons, and then I may want to go back to those beacons or the content of those beacons at some later point in time. And I can do that by clicking on this button here, and this shows me a cover flow of all the places that I've passed. And so if I want to go to some particular place, I can go ahead and click on it, and it will pause the ranging, and it will go out and, set and serve up the content for that particular beacon. Okay? And if I wanted to go back to uh, to ranging again and show me the current content, I could just click on this button right here. It takes me right back into the current content. I can go ahead and close my cover flow as I might want to. So I can serve beacon, I can range beacon content, but then I can also pause it and go back to any place that I've been. As well as I'm doing that, I can click on something and I can hit my trash can and delete it. So if I don't want it in my cover flow or it's a, it's a beacon that I encountered that I really don't care too much about or to keep, I can certainly go ahead and delete that content. Okay, the other thing I can do here, which is kind of interesting, is that I can range my content. So let's go click, I'm going to go click back here, I'm going to click back to range it. So let's go back to the elegy. I can share the content as well. So go ahead, if I click on this little button right here, I can go ahead and text that to somebody or Twitter it to somebody or th things like that so that I can actually share this particular content as I might want to. Okay. I can also do things like, for example, uh, I'm going to serve up content for different languages. So you'll notice, by the way, that currently the text in here is in Spanish. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and change my settings. Click on this little button right here and change my settings. Oops, no, that was my history. I don't want to do that. I'm going to change my settings, and you can see I've got different settings here. Let's get it get a good view that you can see. And language is currently set on Spanish. I'm going to go ahead and change my language to um, U.S. English and hit done. I'll hit done here. And then you'll see that now the content is in fact in English. So there's a whole lot of other features as well. Um, some of the other things that you can you can serve up any kind of content you can put audio you can put video we've got um, different images here we've got a video um, if I want to as well and by the way you can use templates for the content management system you can have structured lists you can do URL reference links uh, things like that but also if I have embedded links in here notice I just jumped out here to the actual um, store so I can go ahead and shop if I want to, and when I'm done shopping, I can hit done, and it immediately takes me right back to where I was. So, Place App, 
Um, place content management system and place beacons are all available and uh, I hope you do check them out. Um, please do uh, contact us with any questions. Again, www.westcompass.com and we look forward to talking to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.